Hey, what is up guys? Jeremy here and welcome back to another tweak video. We're going to be taking a look at an awesome tweak from Cydia. It is called Meteor. Now what this tweak does is as you guys can see with my weather uh, application on my home screen here, it does display the current temperature and weather conditions as an app icon, uh, which is really awesome you know, just for doing that. Uh, there's a lot of older um, tweaks that have done this before, but I really like the way that the developer uh, made the style of the app icon. I think it just flows with the rest of iOS. And another cool thing that Meteor does is if you guys look up in my status bar, um, you can see that the current weather and temperature is displayed there as well. So um, it's really nice, you know, being on your lock screen. You don't even have to go into your device. You can just simply wake your device up and you can see what the current temperature and weather conditions are for your location. So very, very cool tweak. Um, and that's pretty much what it does. But there's some options to configure. So we can go ahead and go into the settings. Scroll down to Meteor right here. And I'll give you guys a run through of this. So you have your enabled on off switch, which is pretty standard for tweaks. You have your configure locations. Now this is done very easily. It's done right through your stock iOS weather application itself. So whatever um, location you have as your first location in the weather app, that is the information that this tweak is going to pull. So that's basically how that works. You have your update interval. By default, it's at 30 minutes, which I've found to be perfectly fine. Uh, you could bump it up to as fast as every five minutes. Keep in mind that that's going to be more draining on your battery than every 30 minutes. And if you go up to like, let's say four hours, that's going to be the least draining on your battery. I think 30 minutes um, works perfectly fine. I've not noticed my battery being any different, um, you know, in terms of how long it lasts with this tweak. Uh, you also do have the option to use local weather. So local weather requires location services uh, to enable for the weather application. You do have your uh, option to toggle on the weather icon. So if we toggle this off, it's not going to show the uh, the live weather conditions and temperature on your app icon. It'll be the default app icon. I like keeping it on because I like the way it looks. And then you can also replace the icon text with the current temperature. So that's a pretty cool uh, option to do. Obviously, I have all of my icon names hidden, so I don't and, uh, you know I don't use that. It is enabled, but you can't see it, so it doesn't really matter to me. Uh, you also do have the options to configure the status bar. I really like this. You can actually p uh, change the position for both the um, icon and the temperature, which is pretty nice. So at the top, you do have the ability to turn off the status bar temperature. So if you don't want the temperature, you can just turn it off. I like having it enabled. Again, like I said, you can change the icon's position between left and right. I keep mine to the left, which keeps my status bar, you know, nice and even looking. Um, you can display the temperature unit, which would sh show Fahrenheit for me. Uh, obviously, if you're Fahrenheit or Celsius, that's what that does. I know it's Fahrenheit, so I don't have that displayed. I just keep it off. And then you do have the status bar condition. Uh, you can turn that on or off where it shows the actual condition of the weather for your location. And again, with this, you can switch it from left to right, which is pretty awesome. And then once you've made your changes, you will have to, uh, you know, respring your device with the relaunch springboard button right there. I'm not going to do it just because I have it completely set up the way I like. And that's pretty much all there is to it uh, for Meteor. It's a really cool, you know, well implemented, very nicely designed tweak from Cydia. Uh, it is $1.99. It is a paid tweak. It is from the Big Boss repo. I'll leave all of the package information uh, down in the description for those of you that might want to try out this tweak. I would highly recommend it. I think it's a really nice tweak. And again, being able to, you know, see your temperature and weather condition uh, on the status bar from your lock screen is just really nice. It's a real simple, great tweak. So again, this is Meteor. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick review. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more tweak videos in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.